that the gas that we are talking about belongs to Trinidad and Tobago, the people of Trinidad and Tobago. With that reminder, OWTU head Ansel Roger issued another call for the new pricing formula agreed to by the government and BP in January be reviewed and renegotiated. Through that negotiations, BP is now receiving some 100% increase for the gas produced. And as a result of that, the gas users throughout the country, but more specifically and particularly at the industrial estate in Point Lisas, uh, those plants can no longer operate. It is no longer viable for them to operate. Mr. Roger maintains the deal was not in the best interest of Trinidad and Tobago, and it has resulted in a series of plant closures with the imminent threat of shutting down the entire Point Lisas industrial estate. These companies are finding it impossible to pay this onerous 100% price increase agreed by NGC and BP. Therefore, this has resulted in a series of plant closures with the imminent threat of shutting down of the entire Point Lisas industrial estate. For example, Yara International has already closed one of its plants and will be forced to close their other two plants, Stringent 1 and Stringent 2, affecting hundreds of workers. He wants citizens to get a fair share of the pie. We believe this is absolutely necessary to ensure that our fragile economy is not further damaged by this new pricing formula and that our people benefit from the resources of our land. He says the union is respectfully awaiting a response, but they are not willing to let this issue slide. Stacey Ann Providence, TTT News.